We're here with Wilkes University men's basketball sophomore Rob Pecorelli and freshman Jack Bova after the Colonels opened their season with an 83-58 win over Penn State Hazleton at the March Center on Wednesday evening. Guys, talk to us about the importance of opening the season with a victory. Well, always opening the season with a victory is important for us just to kick things off right, get confidence going to the rest of the season, and just get everyone feeling good. Yeah, as Rob said, it felt great to get a first win. It gives us a lot of confidence going into the rest of the year against some good teams. Rob, you made your first career start last night, and you looked more than comfortable out there. Tell us about what was going through your head prior to tip-off. Well, I just uh, had a plan to, if I was open, shoot the ball with confidence and uh, try to get my teammates involved, not really worried about which shot I was going to take, just take good shots, and uh, hopefully they fell. You scored a career-high 23 points on 5 of 10 shooting from three-point range. When did you start to feel like you were getting hot out there? Uh, after the first one went in, uh, it was definitely a relief just to get, see the ball go through the net and uh, give me confidence for the rest of the game just to keep shooting. Jack, you're extremely efficient, totaling 13 points in 15 minutes off the bench yesterday. Talk to us a little bit about your performance. Um, I thought I played pretty well. I did some good things on the, both sides of the floor, shooting-wise and on the defensive end, and some rebounds off free throws and stuff like that. But I was a little nervous going into the game, but as the game went on, it felt better. Now, yesterday you suited up for your first collegiate game. How did it feel putting on that Colonel's jersey for the first time? It felt great. I've been waiting a long time for this to put on a jersey and get out there and play with the brothers. Wilkes men's basketball returns to action on Saturday when it travels to Elizabethtown for a 3 p.m. non-conference matchup.